Now, here are your latest headlines and updated Kansas City forecast from KSHB 41 News. I'm Caitlin Knute. Here are your headlines this Tuesday, July 12th. The Missouri State Highway Patrol has identified the man killed Sunday night in Westport. They say 24-year-old Cardell Crawford was shot outside Westport Ale House. This happened around 11 Sunday night. Police say it started with a large disturbance inside the bar that then spilled outside, and that's where multiple shots were fired. We do know some off-duty police officers were there working security, and they fired back. Right now, it's unknown if anyone was hit by shots actually fired by officers. Crawford was killed. Five others were injured. Their conditions have not been released. We do know a security guard was among those shot. Today marked the final day for Kansans to get registered to vote for the August 2nd primary. Now, there is still some time for you to get registered online. You have until midnight. Another important date to remember is July 26th. That's your deadline to request a mail-in ballot. Early voting also begins that day. Schools will be back in session next month, and KCK Public Schools want to make sure your student is ready. That's why they're hosting a free immunization clinic tomorrow at J.C. Harmon High School. It's happening from 3 until 6.30 p.m. The clinic will allow students to get caught up on required and recommended vaccines. Students must be accompanied by a parent or legal guardian. Now here's Gary with the weather. All right, Kate, then we're looking at a chance of thunderstorms by Saturday, but even that's just 30%. Tomorrow, no chance of rain, 84 by noon. The humidity is still fairly much in check, 90 degrees. The south wind will start increasing that humidity a little bit. 88 degrees at 6, 93 Thursday. There is that 30% chance of thunderstorms Friday and Saturday. And the next week, we heat up 91 Sunday, 92 Monday. And some of the models getting close to 100 degrees. So we will monitor that closely. Remember to get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.